What you do next matters. Make sure to call Sweet James Accident Attorneys. Every month, my firm and I help hundreds of people get the medical treatment they need and the financial compensation they deserve, all without paying a dime out of pocket. Recently, five out of the top 50 settlements in California came from Sweet James. Call the firm awarded best attorneys in America. Call Sweet James. Nick Fury's six-episode event has arrived. This is personal. It's riveting. The world is on the line. It's Marvel at its best. Got that right. Nick Fury in Marvel Studios' Secret Invasion, now streaming only on Disney+. Plus. Indiana Jones and the Dial of Destiny, now playing only in theaters. Fostering a pet for a friend or neighbor can keep families together. Learn more at petsandpeopletogether.org. Live from ABC7, this is Eyewitness News. When I seen that fire, it broke my heart. Now at 10 a.m., a community devastated after watching their neighborhood store burn. The latest in the investigation into the large fire. Jamboree days are underway here in Crestline. I'm Lithi Suarez with a look at how this community is staying strong. And extreme heat slamming Southern California this weekend. The beach is definitely the place to be today and tomorrow. How long this dangerous heat will last. Good morning, I'm Irene Cruz. And I'm Tony Cabrera. Mark has the morning off this morning, but we want to get to the forecast because I'm sitting in for Mark. Shayla's sitting in for me. <laughs> Musical chairs, <laughs> I like it. Um, and like you said, it is going to be a hot weekend. So the beach, definitely the place to be. Try to beat that heat. Have the sunscreen handy. You are going to need it. We've got heat warnings in place, heat advisory, you name it. But we're at least starting with some cooler temperatures before things get toasty this afternoon. Here's a look from downtown LA. we got blue skies out there, but we're already starting to see those temperatures climb 75 degrees right now if you're heading out the door downtown and then Disneyland it is a beautiful start to the morning at Disneyland but again it's going to be a hot one so make sure you are staying hydrated if you're out at the park 73 right now really light wind so overall temperatures pretty comfortable still we are starting to see some areas already get into the 80s 90s as you head inland so 80 degrees in Wrightwood Palmdale coming in at 94 already and it's only going to get warmer from here a little a little bit cooler those you head to the beaches most of you guys are in the 60s here's a look at the values today so 90s by the time we get to noon some of you guys are going to see those triple digits breaking it all down plus that seven day forecast when and where we're going to see the most of that heat but for now irene and tony i'll toss it back to you too okay shayla thank you a teen driver has been arrested for a deadly hit and run in arcadia this happened at huntington drive and myrtle avenue around 11:30 last night Police said they attempted to pull over the 17 year old for speeding when he drove through a red light and hit a pedestrian. The suspect drove off as officers stopped to help the pedestrian who died at the scene. Officers found the suspect hiding in some shrubs and arrested him. The identity of the victim has not been released yet. Investigators are trying to figure out what caused a massive fire in South Los Angeles overnight. It happened at Best Bargain on Broadway and 41st Street. It took 80 firefighters over an hour to put out the flames. Several people in the community came out to watch their local store go up in flames. Many say they are devastated because it's one of the few affordable places to buy food in the neighborhood. When I seen that fire are expected. Of course, it looks pretty calm there, but you see traffic starting to build up on the exit there. There are already dozens of delays and a few cancellations. Meantime, the state's annual gas tax goes in effect today. Every year, the tax increases by four cents a gallon, totaling 58 cents a gallon. Eyewitness News reporter Amy Powell has more on the travel crunch. Millions of Southern Californians are on the roads, enjoying 4th of July getaways. During what could be a record-breaking holiday travel period, around 43 million Americans are expected to drive to their destinations. After struggling to fill their vehicles as gas prices soared last summer, drivers are finding prices at the pump have dropped. It's not that bad compared to other times. In L.A. County, the average price